What is up guys, it is Z, and today I'm bringing you guys a little unboxing and review of the DDD4 Mini, and as you can tell, it is currently not plugged in, you're listening through the onboard mic of the Sony ZV-E10, but we got the mic right here, I'm ready to unbox this guys, so hope y'all are ready. Okay, so first things first, let's open her up, this came in the mail today from Amazon. So they have this one and they also have the Duo, which is the mic and it has one in the back as well. So this this one will run you about 50 bucks and if you want to get the Duo, it will run you about 20, 30 bucks more. Um, prices will be uh, posted right here on the video and also links in the description down below if you guys want to cop these guys. But um, let's get straight into it. So it's got a little protection, little protection, little thing going on here. But I'm excited. So... For those of you who are in the market for buying a microphone, I have been doing a bunch of research and this thing is still one of the best options you can get for the price of course. There's better things out there, but okay, so we got it open, let's pull it out, anything else in the box, nothing crazy, some manuals, a little, little, some, little something on the back, kind of what it does, what it, what it features it provides. Take her out. And there you go. So one, some cool features about this mic. Let's get straight into it. Some cool features is, um, first off, you get two cables. You get one so you can plug into your um, mobile devices and anything else that has a 3.5 millimeter jack. As well as another input. And with that, you can plug in a lav mic or a wireless receiver. And any audio that is inputted through it uh, will be split. So you can change any of the audio levels with that. It also comes with a windscreen, a shock mount, and it also is a super cardioid mic versus a cardioid. And with that, it is a little bit punchy and a little bit louder than your um, counterpart microphones. And one other thing, it has RF shielding, which allows for a receiver to be kind of close to without interfering. Okay, we're going to test the body mic, and we're going to test the DDD4 Mini, and also we're going to compare it against my AT2005, and we'll see how it compares with the three. So for the DD and the body, for the ZV-E10, we're going to be doing outside and indoors, and this is a semi-treated room, so there won't be as much reverb and stuff like that, but uh, unfortunately my AT2005, I won't be able to take that out. But we're going to test those. So right now you're listening on the body of the ZV-E10. Testing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And let's go ahead and go to the DD-D4 Mini. Okay, so now the DD-D4 Mini is plugged in. Uh, testing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. And now we're testing the Audio Technica 2005. Testing 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. This is the onboard body mic of the ZV-E10. Testing one, two, three, four, five. This is the DDD4. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, so looking at all those mics, all three of these, you can tell a difference if you listen closely. So the body of the ZV-10 outdoors, it sounds like you're in an enclosure and having the DDD4 Mini brings it, makes it very vibrant. You hear a lot of the background sounds, which if you want to get rid of that stuff, you can probably do a lot of um, post-production uh, audio editing. If you want to get rid of that, I think it brings more character to it. They're not, the outside sounds aren't very loud. And from in person, it was pretty loud for myself. So it did do a decent job of dimming it down with the um with the dead cat on it so i do believe that the ddd4 mini is the best option for your bang for the buck for 2022 it's been over a year since this has been out and all the research i've done it is still one of the best mics you can buy for your camera so go on ahead go ahead go down in the description click that link if you're interested in it and again i posted the prices of these um the duo is on sale right now currently as of september 21st 2022 but that could always change and sometimes during the fall you might get some extra sales so make sure you guys check that out maybe then but i hope you guys enjoyed this video make sure you subscribe like and comment and comment down below what you guys want to see um i have plenty of other camera gear maybe i can do some reviews on those maybe we can do a review or a little video of what's in my bag my camera bag uh, so stuff like that but i hope you guys enjoyed and i will see you guys in the next video peace Oh, <laughs>